Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to The Great Expanse on Voxel Tycoon. Yeah, so last time around we got some uh, uh, copper production thingy going on over here, right, at the factory. Now, what we need to do is get, uh, get something else uh, going on here, uh, which is going to be, uh, well, doing something with the copper bars right but first we need to fix the conveyors over here like this yeah you know because the stuff not getting into there is not going to uh well make the uh, production work very well now is it right now what we need to do um right so we're going to produce uh copper wires out of this And doing that needs a, uh, um, factories. Yeah. Uh, which is, uh, presses, right now, uh, I can't remember how, how fast these things run. I think I probably want two presses uh, for each. Each output here. Right. Um, okay, so, so that's going to be wires. Uh, now, uh, the reason for this is we've got two smelters, right? So, uh, so I'm going to need to go here and, uh, do this and this and this. Yeah. Okay. Now, what are we going to do with the, uh, with those? Well, we're going to do something really clever. And, well, I don't know if it's clever, but we're going to stick it in a warehouse. Yeah, I, I know. That's just, just uh, crazy talk, isn't it? Uh, we need a warehouse to do that, though. That's going to be wire. Yes. Uh, right, so now we're going to need a uh, conveyor connector. Now, I wish the connector was the default. Is unless there's a uh, merger where you can control the rates of uh, the inputs going on to the output conveyor, the filter splitter is not useful. Uh, because it just, uh, it just ends up, um, um, what's the, the word? Um, it ends up, uh, Okay, we're going to need to split this up, actually. Yeah, I'm going to need a second one of those. Uh, just because of the uh, production rates, I think. So we'll just do that. Okay. Uh, right. Right, okay, conveyor, right, so we come across like this, like this, we come across like this, and like this, yep, you connect, you connect, and you connect, okay, now we'll make sure those are all going the right way, Those are going the right way. You need those to be going the right way. Okay. Okay, we've got a, a glitchy thing there. Uh, and we got a glitchy thing there. 
Okay. Why do we have a glitchy thing looking thing there? Uh, whatever. Uh, yeah, okay. You know, um, Right. Okay. Uh, probably my imagination on the glitchy stuff there. Uh, okay. Well, we've got that going on. So, we'll... Uh, so, it looks like I could probably drive three or four from each, uh, each smelter pair there. Yeah. Yeah, and it looks like I really need uh I need more. Okay, so so I guess that means I'll I'll have uh, a pretty good uh chance of just running everything uh at a uh high uh uh, you know, like a fairly high throughput going out of there to the next stage in in producing things. Now, up here, we are producing copper wires, right? We are. And are we taking them anywhere? We are. Uh, so, do we have anything? We're not taking copper bars anywhere? No. So, we can remove that. Yeah, um, but we are taking copper somewhere. Okay, so what I can do is uh, bring this out somewhere to a uh, pickup point. Um, now, how I could do that by... Well, I can put a connector on here. Bam. And then I could run across down toward here. Right. Okay. Now, if I were to put a uh, warehouse, a warehouse, and if I were to put one of those here, I don't know, here? Let's put it here. And if we call that copper wire, and then if we uh, grab the uh, road stuff, uh, put a, a station, um, I think if we come down to here, the garage will fit. No, I have to go one further, okay. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, now the garage will fit. Yep, okay. Well, that should work. Good. So, if we bring this across and this up, yeah. Okay, we can move. Oh, right. I need to. Right. I need a conveyor connector on here. Um, guess we'll put it here. Yeah. Then we'll uh, take the. Uh, stub off and then I think yeah we can do this how far can we go 
Oh, we can go up and over the whole way. Let's do that. Because it looks cool. Right. And we will uh, send that out there. And then we'll come up he here to the... Um, here. Uh, we'll edit this and we will uh, pick a destination here. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. And this is factory panes pickup. This is factory wire pickup. Okay. Good. Now what are we going to do? Stuff. Oh. No, what we're going to do is remove some of this stuff up here. Yeah, because we don't need this uh, or this whole operation up here. In fact, we don't need any of this. So this, uh, if we go here and we do this, this, and this, and we send that to here and here and here, right? Then we can sell all, yes. And then we can remove that. Yes. Then we can take this out. Uh huh. And we can take that out. Right. And then we can take all of this business out. Right. And this is basically the whole um, operation for uh, consolidating everything, right? Right, so we uh, take all of this business out here. Right, and take that out, and that out, and that out. Right, okay. Okay, we can leave that. Uh, leave that alone now. Right. Now we have um, we have copper wire doing its thing over here in the factory. Uh, so that when this uh, copper source runs out, uh, it becomes uh, a lot uh, easier to uh, change things around. Yeah. Uh, so that's the uh, basic idea. Something else that we can do probably is, is just have a copper get picked up over here too. Uh, so that when the copper source does run out, the trucks don't have to be re-configured, uh, re, uh, right? Now the question is, where, where do I want to uh, do that pickup? Because that's a raw resource, so you kind of want something that's in range of the uh, station, right? But I don't think we're going to get anything. What's the... Uh, um, now, if we were to do this... Uh, 
Well, that, if we were to take a warehouse and put it here, oh, that's in range. Are we dropping the copper off here? We are. Okay, that'll work. Right, so we can go in here and we can stick a warehouse right here. Bam, that can be copper ore. Yeah, okay. Well, then we can grab uh, a garage right there. Nope. Uh, we're going to need the um, station first, aren't we? Right. Stations. Right. And then we grab the garage. Right. And then we do the road business, right? Yeah, we do. Okay. We do the road business. And this is going to be factory copper or pickup. Yeah. Okay. What the? No. That needs to be a garage two. There's no percentage in using a garage one. Okay. Good. Now, we can come over here, and we can get rid of the rest of this operation here. Uh, we can go here. No, we can do this. We can edit, and we can move it to the other thing. So this is why you really want to make routes. Uh, okay, and then this one. Uh, okay, edit. Right. Okay. Yep. Right. So that's really why you want to make the uh, the routes when you have multiple vehicles, and you can move them, move the um, source point easily. Right. Okay. Take that off. Yeah. Okay. Now that's, that's on the grid, so we can just leave that. Okay. Now here, uh, logistics. The warehouse is in range, so we can just leave it. Good. Okay. Now what does that uh, get us? Well, not much anything, really. We've just uh, rejiggered our uh, pickups, right? Uh, where's the... Uh, Oh, there's the copper train. Okay. Um, and we can speed that up by uh, adding a couple of uh, uh, copper mines here. Just like that. Okay. Now let's um, let's just uh, let's take a ride on here and just observe whether this is uh, working as we expect it to. Um, right, so we uh, tick along this way and we do something. Right. Well, uh, that's uh, definitely uh, it's definitely a train ride, isn't it? Yeah. Not exactly the most efficient uh, path that this could take, is it? But that's what happens when your uh, pickup point is like next door to the drop off point.
and yay we come along into the thing why does it go why did it pick the right hand track there Well, that definitely works just fine. Yeah, I don't know why it picked the... Uh... Okay. That... I suppose I also need to get uh, these other uh lanes here connected up yeah yeah i think i do uh, okay so we're going to do that yeah, like this uh, like this like this yep and then we put a regular signal here here in here yeah okay then we need to come out to here come out to here and do this and do this yep okay now can we get under or over that Does that get low enough? Uh, that's only two down. No, that's not low enough. Okay. Uh, okay. That does get low enough, though. So we need one, two, three, four, one, two, three. So we need to do that. Okay. Uh, okay, so let's uh, let's pause. We'll take that out and we'll come along here. Nope. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that and connect that okay yeah that's fine that will that should allow everything to do uh, what I want okay well that does make things work but we don't need to do the under on that one that was just for measuring we'll let this one go level yeah okay now what do we need to do we need to finish the approach tracks here right uh, so to do that we need to come out to here uh, out like about to here you know what if we do this yeah it's a little less uh, wonky if we do that no right okay now, if we come across here, do this, do this, okay. This comes up like this and into here, yeah. Yeah, that looks right, okay. Now, what do we need? We need more signals, right? So we need one of these here, right? And we need one of these here and here. Yeah. Yeah. And then we need one of these 
here and here and regular ones here and here. Okay. Right. Now, uh, what's passing here? We have the copper ore and we have the sand. Okay. So, what I want to do, uh, I want to I want to edit this and then we want to go here and this is the copper, right? So we're going to turn these tracks off. Okay. All right. And then this is the uh, sand, right? We're going to do this. I'm going to turn those tracks off. Yeah. What? Wait. Hello? Okay. Right. Um, right. Okay. So now, if we were to uh, skip the current order on that one and skip the current order on that one right now let's just up the tempo here that should allow the um right what weird okay that should ultimately get them to the correct um, tracks. Yeah, okay, so that one goes there. Yep. Now, where's the... Which one's train number details? Um... Right, we can turn that off. Okay, so we have our copper. And, okay, so now they have come into the uh, track sets that I've set aside for them. Let's do the same with these ones. No, let's not. Uh, yeah, we need, to, we need to do the same thing with these tracks. Yeah, yeah, we do. Okay, well, uh, we've got a couple minutes here. Let's just um, uh, uh, put a couple tracks in here. Nope, let's uh, line them up properly, shall we? Right, no, we don't need this to be paused. Right, okay. Now let's try that again, shall we? Um, here. And then here. Yeah, and then here. And then here. Yeah, okay. Now, that means these can come up this way you no you yeah no that's not lined up properly okay you yeah and then you no you no yeah uh don't mind me that's just my cdo getting all over everything um right let's um let's take that bit out and uh yeah we'll do that take that bit out and we'll do that. Yeah, take this bit out. 
uh, flatten this bit. Yeah, and then we we have this bit and this bit goes up to that bit. Yeah, and this bit comes onto here, and then we clean the buffers up. Right. Okay. Now what do we do? Well, signals. Okay, we need a pre-signal here and a pre-signal there. Yeah. And a pre-signal here, here. Um... What? Okay. We need to come off of here. No. No, we need to come off of here. Yeah. Right. There we go. Good. Then we need regular signals here here, here, and here. Right. Good. And then we need the crossover thingies here. Okay, and that comes in that way. And then around into there. Well, if we do this, yeah. Then we can take this out. Right. And this one. Uh, that goes up this way and then it goes around that way. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, then we're going to have to do this. And yes, I do know that those tracks are too close together. Okay. Now, uh, we need this, this, and that's fine. Yes. Good. Now, we need to just do this. Okay. And like this. Now, we grab this. Here and here, here and here. Yeah, good. We have now uh, got the coal one uh, sorted out. And then we go edit and we go any track. We just turn those tracks off and then it can't go wrong. Yeah. Okay, and then we take our uh, iron train and we uh, edit that and do this. Turn these platforms off. Wait, what? No, go here. Do that. Okay. Okay, that leaves these two platforms for uh, wood deliveries. Right. Okay. Ultimately, these also need to connect in. Um, well, it looks like I can actually uh, just uh, bring these tracks in here. And then we can go like this. No, we can go like this and like this. <clears throat> Right, and then we can put our 
uh, pre-semaphores there. Yeah. Okay, that gets us our uh, setup there. It doesn't quite line up, but when I take these out, I can make it line up. Okay. Wait, this comes in this way and down this way. Or it comes in this way. What the... What the bleep... What... Huh? Right. Okay. Either way, we're coming in this way. To here or to here. So that comes in. That comes around. That comes around. We don't need these tracks. Okay. Good. Right. I don't know what I what I'm up to here, but that's that's weird. Okay. Right. Well, that's the approaches for the uh, big station here. Yeah. I have to rejigger the exits, but uh, the approaches are. Uh, basically sorted good well i i guess uh you know that's probably enough of a project for for uh for this uh this episode um we're uh getting progress toward uh woodworking um just checking in on this um uh, here, um, but things can, uh, can continue, uh, doing their thing there. Uh, next, uh, next time around, uh, I think we'll end up, uh, doing some more stuff here with, um, oh yeah, we're going to have to start bringing other, uh, resource sources online. Yeah. So moving the, uh, the wood, uh, production stuff over to the factory is probably the thing to do. now that we've opened up some space on this side. Okay, that's probably what we'll do. So, uh, I'm going to uh, I'm going to call it a part here, and uh, we'll see what happens next time. I'm not completely sure what I'm going to do, but I'll find something to do, right? And uh, yeah, so stay healthy, uh, and you know, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, dislike even if you like. Uh, whatever f feels right to you, you know, uh, you're the one that will probably derive any benefit from it if there is any right yeah uh so you know do what you're gonna do and see you back next time